look what came. Okay, I did this because, as I've mentioned more than once, um, I have bad arthritis in my hands. And for some reason, it really doesn't seem to cause me a problem when I'm holding a needle. But trying to hold a pen is very painful, and I don't have any strength, and my writing is atrocious. So, I got these little cards made. Because when I send out my patterns, I want to put a little thank you in there. I want to say, you know, thank you for commenting, thank you for watching, participating, that sort of thing. But I couldn't find any nice stationery, and everything I found was a card, and the card didn't fit in the envelope, and there was drama, all right? There was drama. And then I thought about Vistaprint and how dang cheap they tend to be. Look at this! This was cool. I got a hundred of these delivered for, I think, under $19. I want to say it was like 18-something. Can't really argue with that. So they're just, you know, they have my information on one side, blank on the other, so I can just write a quick little thank you so that, you know, I've interacted with the nice people who are interacting with me. But, um, you know, I don't have to try to grip a pen for too long to do it. And you can put all manner of information on there. I just sort of filled in the blanks. But I thought this was a pretty cool idea. They give you a refer a friend link, but they're not really clear on whether it's like something that I should be able to put in the description of my video to lead people to the site. If you, if you were to click on that associate link and buy something, I get some sort of credit for it kind of thing. Um, so if they let me put the link in the description, I will. If they don't, and you want to help a girl out, um, go ahead and send me an email and I will email you the link because that's totally their gig. They're like, yeah, go ahead, email them all over the place. You know, just don't bulk mail anything. Um, so I will do that. But I thought it was a good idea and cheap enough and easy. Cheap and easy. That's my nickname in high school. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Well, almost zero progress. I didn't do, did one little bit of stitching today over here. Um, it's been a long day. It was, uh, it's orthodox, it's orthodox Easter today, so we went to dinner and whatnot, and it was candy. I'm tired. Um, haven't been having the greatest few days, so I think I am just going to stretch out and relax tonight, and I'm going to be back at this on Monday. I will talk to you guys then. Bye, guys. Hey there. It is Monday night, and yet again, I forgot to do a little, hey, this is what I'm going to stitch on tonight. So I just stitched on it, and that's what happened. Um, but I got a lot done. I, um, I'm not at my best right now. I've got, there's things, they're in my head, they're outside my head. It's many things. But... This is my work for tonight, and I'm going to go get comfy, and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye, guys. So, yeah, it's five minutes of six in the morning, and it's a little foggy out here. Passed a terrible-looking accident on the way here. Today's going to be a good day. I need today to be a good day. Hey, look, it's Edgar. I am trying to get back to normal this week. I'm not doing a great job of it, but hey, we'll see how far I can get on him. He's not looking like Hitler anymore. He's looking decidedly a lot more like Edgar Allan Poe, which is a comfort to all of us. Let's see what I can get done. I will check back in later. Bye, guys. He's getting so Edgary. 
Oh, good for Edgar. He's coming along nicely. I have new enthusiasm for this. Some new enthusiasm. It's going to move quickly now. Look at him. He's all face and stuff. All right. Time for coffee. Time to get comfy. Talk to you later. Well, now that the Novocaine has worn off and I can speak, I made a bit of progress today. Um, I got all the curly cues at the top done, and I did a few more of the little backstitch bits and pieces. I gotta tell you, I'm actually thinking of picking, you know, some of these little diamonds out. I don't think it needs them, and they look terrible. Look at them. It's because, you know, Ada and... Some of these aren't on a corner or a hole and things and stuff and reasons and excuses and whatever. So I don't know. I'll think about that. But he's looking nice. He's looking handsome. It is Thursday night and I am hanging out. Danielle? She's telling me all about her new phone. I think it's time for some more coffee. I don't think I'm going to stitch anymore. Find something else to do. But I will check back in tomorrow. Bye, guys.